Welcome back to Spyro 2. Hello everybody, how are you all doing today? We're gonna enter Hurricanes. A very dangerous place, if you will. So in here, we're gonna have the wonderful Tom Kenny voicing every single person we encounter. So that's gonna be fun. And we have more of these little clips. Oh Jesus, those guys. Everyone's picking on these little guys. What the heck? Oh! What thieves? Do to do, do to do. Back to gathering everything. We've always had trouble with the gear grinders, but now they've set up force fields to separate us. If you can find diodes, you can use them to turn off the force fields. <laughs> I think there's a diode around here somewhere, but my eyesight isn't what it used to be. This is probably the most prominent one that's similar to the sound of Spongebob. Whoop! I know that he voices a lot of other characters in this game, but I'm not entirely sure which one. You kind of... you kind of don't really notice it until you hear it. But this is also one of the more convoluted levels. There's just... there's so much to go and grab. And I don't know if if people are right on this or not, but they've mentioned I've seen people mention this whole theory that Insomniac Games they went on to make uh, the Ratchet and Clank series, and that they got the idea for Ratchet and Clank from these two enemies here. I I kind of think it's a coincidence, but I'm not entirely sure. Yeah, okay. <laughs> totally not paying attention. Uh, we'll get over there later. For now, though, continue on in here. Today's gonna be sort of a uh, short episode. I'm just sort of uh, doing a last minute recording. <laughs> uh, like, I don't know, it is it is midnight of the day that this is gonna be going up. So I sort of ran out of my backlog <laughs> already. Uh, work's been kind of a pain and getting back into making sure that I've got everything all set up has been a bit of a challenge. However, uh, today, like while you guys are watching this, I'm going to be working on getting Psychonauts up, so it's going to be a lot later than usual. Uh, Psychonauts will not come up um, the same time as this one. Like it has been for the last couple of days. Ow! Ow! Don't do that! But, I've got the day off today, so I'm also going to be using that time to work on a couple of things. Probably play some Dead by Daylight as well, which I've been enjoying. Um, I've also got some really nice projects that are going to go up on somebody else's channel because I have a friend who streams constantly, um, not constantly, but streams almost every day, and they finally got me some of the video that they want them, they want edited. Oh boy, this mini game. So this, here, let's just, let's just have Tom Kenny explain it. Gear grinder thieves keep taking our lightning stones. If you can replace them all and activate our generator, I'd be very grateful. <laughs> oh, the gear grinders. So, we're gonna put these here. Those gear grinders are gonna show up and they're gonna steal everything. And it's gonna be frustrating because they'll only show up when they're off screen. And as you can see in the little corner, it doesn't matter, uh, there's no, like, um, counter for, like, the things we fill up. Instead, it's more a matter of killing the gear grinder. And we're gonna get these loud, shrill, obnoxious warning signs when those guys spawn up. Ah, oh, yeah, see? 
As a kid, this was one of the most traumatizing sounds for some reason for me. Like, this sound of these gear grinders stealing everything absolutely terrified me as a kid. Did he run off? Oh, that fucker did run off. Oh, hey. There he is. <laughs> Talk about getting lucky. And the the issue, uh, the issue with this minigame is it's more annoying than anything. Um, you know, I'm finding, <laughs> I'm finding that I have a lot to complain about when it comes to Spyro 2. Uh, I really love this game, and I love Spyro 3, but I have a lot to complain about and to bitch about with these games, which is a bit of a concern. Ah, gotcha. Come back here. Gotcha. Granted, Spyro 2 really doesn't have a whole lot of these mini-games. Uh, they more are focused on... Eh, they're focused on a little, little bit things. Insomniac Games kind of treated Spyro 2 as this sort of learning experience. How do you make Spyro more entertaining than just getting gems and fixing everything? Arrgh. Come here, Pop. Oh, are there none, none more over that way? All right, come here. Also, these little buggers just show up the moment you put these damn things down and walk away. Oh, sorry about that, guys. Uh, let's see. Just run away, and eventually somebody will steal something. Or I need to put these all on the right spots. And then from here, it's just a matter of... Oh, hey! No, I'll come back here before you break that. Damn it. Come on. Bonk. There! All the gear grinders are dead. <laughs> We've slaughtered all of them. They will never be an issue again. Is that it? No. I need one more. Uh, okay. Ah, here we go. Come here. Come here, young little one. Do 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 do. Thank you, Spyro. I found this shiny thing mixed up with our lightning stones. Please take it as a reward. Hooray! Got ourselves a nice little orb. So these these levels are a bit uh, convoluted and a pain. Let's see, am I, do I have that charge? I do. Good, good. But I'm pretty sure we can 100% this level. Like, early on, half of the levels in Summer... Summer Falls? Summer Falls? Uh, half of these places can be finished easily. <laughs> I don't know if you can tell if I'm a little tired. I do apologize if you can. Uh, my ability to focus is something that's always been a bit, um, left to be desired, if you will. Do do do. Do. Come here. Get out of here. Oh, there's our little battery. <laughs> oh, how do we get up there? 
Oh god. Jesus, no. Ah, fuck it. No, hold on. Um, let's get the talisman first. I know that we're gonna want that. Thank you, Spyro. You've deactivated all of the electric barriers. Thank you, SpongeBob. Talisman from the gear grinders. Please take it as a reward. Ooh. Oracle's talisman. Do -do -do -do. <laughs> and then we get zapped by a fairy. Okay, so here's the here's the tricky thing about this level. Uh, you remember that supercharge that we used in the Tiki place? Yeah, it's back. We gotta we gotta break all of these fans open. Okay, come on. Because it'll slow these things down so that we can do some platforming. Yep. Oh, fantastic. Thankfully, these are not on timers. Hit them once, once and done. Okay, that's the one I need to hit. Oh boy, there's two of these things I gotta hit. Hit that one first. Over down. Do do do. do. And schmack. Oh, come on now. Let's try again. Let's try again. Let's try again this time for real. You see that big building over there? The gear grinders are using it to steal our electricity. Please help us by They're shutting stealing down the, the electricity. Inside. We must save it. Uh, so wonderful, wonderful platforming that we have to do here. And by wonderful, I mean not really. Uh, we slowed those things down, but we slowed them down to a real crawl. Granted, we could always just do this. Oh yeah, there's nothing over here. This way, though. Whoop! Nice! Nice flying, buddy. Spyro, you've done well so far. <laughs> what the you electro? You can have this little trinket for good luck. <laughs> if you have any questions about shutting down the factory, just ask me. Eh, we'll be fine. I think we got this. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. The next glides get tricky. You'll have to use your hover maneuver to make them. Press the triangle. <laughs> I know how to hover. I'm a dragon. Do, 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 do. See? Nothing to it. That didn't take me 10,000 tries. Why can't I... Change the camera angle. Ooh. Okay. Trixie jumps. Is she gonna zap me from all the way up here? No, she's not. We can, however, make this. Yay! Skill check. Skill point. Oop. Oh no. Oh, make it. Oh boy. Oh, jeez. Spyro, help! The switch to turn off the gear grinder factory is in that room, but, um, it's awfully noisy in there. No! <laughs> you can't handle the noise. It's not too loud. 
thanks for shutting down the factory. Here, I found this stuck between the gears. You can have it if you want. Why would the orb be stuck between the gears? Why would you put orbs between gears? Why would you do that? That's gonna cause problems. Do you wanna cause problems? Is that what you want? I guess it is what he wants. Up. Okay, this jump we can easily make. Give these to me. What am I missing? Missing like seven gems. Oh god. Oh no. Not this. Not this again. Not like this. The search for a bajillion gems. I know there are no gems in the uh, gear grinder lightning stone section. Arr, there's a five. There's a fiver. One, two, three. Yeah. Oh yeah. Hurt coast is completed. Shiny. Fishing line! How tricky! Oh no! You broke his glasses! That's mean. Okay, cool. So that's Hurricos for ya. Uh, we can't do that. We've done most of Sunny Beach. We could go talk to Moneybags, but I don't wanna. What do we, what do we got for the guidebook? Uh, just one left, okay. Sunny Beach we can't finish, and Glimmer, and Glimmer we can't finish, and Forest we can't finish. Everything else we've finished so far. Uh, for now though, let's go over here. Into the Ocean Speedway. So I want to show off the this sort of mechanic thing. It's in all three levels, all three overworlds. There's one for each. And it's just like it was in Spyro 1. Oh, fuck. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, I fucked up. I screwed up! Oh, no. Oh, fuck. Let's, let's restart this. <laughs> let's restart this. In order to get all the gems, and that's what this is, is you want to do this for all the gems that it gives. Uh, you have to do it all in one try. Get it all good in one go. I totally forgot how to do things properly, <laughs> so uh, we did not do well. Do to do. Okay, it's so easy to get lost in here. Break the boats! Nice! And we're just gonna run backwards on this thing. Supercharged speedway! Breaking the cars down. It's the fastest way to do it. Going in reverse. It keeps it going. New best time. Okay, so there is a reason to go back into these. As you saw, there was a big crowd over here. Now, I wonder what this could all be. I guess now you think you're pretty good. 
Well, let's see if you're as good as the current champion. Ooh. Um, apparently, if you find her before you finish, she'll be like, oh, you know, you should finish the ra the track first before you play the race. And so now we need to do a race. All right, Spyro. Meet the course champion. In order to win the race, you must fly through all the rings. Beware if Hunter flies through a ring first. The ring will start to shrink. We need to follow Hunter through these rings. And this is by far one of the most frustrating things. Anything involving Hunter is frustrating. Because he's just he's just really good at causing problems. So thankfully this one this one isn't nearly the hardest one. I think um, you know, I'm actually not sure which ones are hard are the hardest. Now that I think about it, they're all challenging in their own right. Like, you just kind of got to follow him and his contrived flying pattern. Oh, I didn't think I grabbed that one. <laughs> Okay, here we go. Not too bad. Guess what, Hunter? I'm gonna torch ya. Great job, Spyro. That was some excellent flying. Thankfully, you don't have to actually beat him. And that's what you get for beating these special stages. Every single one of these flying stages has an orb reward inside of it. You have to beat the stage, and then you get the ore, and then you do the special thing with Hunter, and then you get the orb. <sighs> oh boy. So, before we finish, there's one last thing we have to do. Money bags, what are you hiding from? Hey Spyro, you see this wall here? I bet you're dying to know what's on the other side. If only I had a few more gems, I might be able to remember how to lower the wall. Oh yes, yes, let's go, let's... Let, Mr. Moneybags, bring down that wall. Hmm, yes, the sparkling beauty of those gems seems to have jarred my you. memory. <laughs> Hi, Mr. Moneybags, I'm greedy. I'm gonna keep this world hidden from you. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. The good thing is that, with the way that we're handling this, money bags is literally not an issue. Uh, but yeah, this is the last level of this place, Aquaria Towers. Uh, we will have a look at this one tomorrow. For now, though, I will see you all next time. I hope you all have a lovely rest of your day. If you're enjoying the show, make sure to press that subscription down below. Leave comments if you like. If you want to help grow the channel and help me out a lot, uh, feel free to share everything. Feel free to share the stream or the show and all that fun stuff. I've got a couple of fun, interesting things coming up soon. Uh, we're going to be explorers in the next couple of days. <laughs> so I'll see you all next time. You all have a lovely rest of your night.